metals showed a big swing yesterday with the fed rate cut decision and then chairman powell's speech as expected as predicted see gold claimed 2600 it is struggled at 2600 2602 and i have mentioned that this is till 2602 you have to be careful we can see a reversal beyond 2602 it is not going to come back what has happened we have seen gold reversing beautifully from 2600 and it has seen the lows at 25 47 48 while silver if you see silver 3120 i have mentioned and 3120 beautifully at the same levels it has reversed strongly and has in fact seen the lows at 29 7080 now trading almost flat as of now what to expect today can we expect a recovery can we expect a rise from here or there is a possibility of a reversal and trade bearish again what is going to be our strategy in order to profit trading gold and we are going to see with the help of charts and indicators this is the first update for the day and this is the only channel to give you two updates a day the next critical update will be the before the us session and before the major data release the subscribe to the channel press the bell icon do like share and comment join the free telegram channel for live updates and join the channel membership here on youtube to support the effort please friend press the like button to support the effort let's start first we look into gold followed with silver watch till See big swing was seen here. We have seen gold hitting the highs at twenty six hundred, and now see it is back to this channel. This is a bearish channel in which it is trading. The highs of this channel are now towards twenty five seventy eight eighty. Now only bullishness in gold today is if you see it trading above twenty five eighty two eighty six ninety. These levels are again going to remain crucial and critical for gold for the day. What is happening here? After the drop, it is trading in this retracement channel. the highs at first 2570 very very good resistance here then you can see this 257678 and then 258082 till 2582 is stronger resistance beyond which you can say that it is reversing and then you can look forward to 2586 and 2590 levels though i think it is going to be difficult for gold to break those levels now you can see very clearly it is back to this channel and this is definitely a bearish channel here but see the bearishness is also very much moderate look at the rise this was exponential the drop is bit moderate and hence it has to accelerate and once it draws below 2540 we can say we can look forward to accelerated bearishness where it can look forward to 253032 2520 25, 25 10 25, and then 2500 levels but this appears to be a distant dream for today stock is still rising here MACD after hitting the lows it is now crossing over this crossover can lead to little retracement means there is a possibility for gold to move towards 25 7072 or in fact 76 78 possibilities there RSI comfortable coming to two look at two hour charts moving averages have converged here not yet crossed over price is taking the support here from the 100 period average and also it was all outside bullying the bands and now trying to get back into the bands here now see the bands are looking downwards see when it was bullish it was trading like this now it has turned bearish the slope is on downside if you look at the stock i think this is at bottom the macd is still trading bearish looking downwards the rsi is almost comfortable coming to 3 hour on the 3 hour chart similar observation see one bigger swing candle and a retracement here you can see this the 20 period moving average and the median of the bullinger bands these levels are going to remain critical for gold i will wait for the next candle and if the next candle also takes it on the upside certainly you can see a little bullishness may prevail but also that will increase the chances of a reversal on the downside stock is still oversold macd is bearish here looking downwards rsi is rising coming to four the observation is same on the four hour charts also look at the move here see reversal sign is this one first bearish move retracement second bearish move retracement third bearish move see bearishness is increasing here do not miss bearishness is increasing here with every move and once it breaks below 25 44 40 today if you see it trading below this you can say we can look forward to a greater correction though i see this as a flag formation as well after this bullish move it is trading in this flag formation and a move beyond 25 8082 should be taken up seriously stock is still has dropped macd trading bearish on the 4 hour charts and rsi has dropped as well coming to on the daily charts what has happened see uh, after forming the support here we have seen it rising and if you look at the daily charts see this is the reversal here bullishness getting diminished what has happened yesterday we have seen it 
delivering higher highs and lower lows a bigger swing is seen and now the 20 period moving average is now sitting at around 25 30 35 zone so first is this zone achievable it appears to be achievable as of now if you look at these two candles what has happened a push from the upside is there which means there is bearishness so once it drops today below 25 40 45 you can say we can look forward to a move towards 25 30 32 and in fact it can breach 25 20 as well uh, right now there is a possibility of a slight retracement but i will not treat gold as bullish as long as it stays below 25 80 82 stock stick has dropped here magd is in green trying to converge it is not yet crossed over for sell and rsi has dropped as well so now we have seen the charts and indicators time for me to give you the trading levels and strategy and before i give you the trading levels and strategy if you want to learn this art of trading join my mentorship batch if you just want to trade as per the signals be a part of my signals channel on telegram connect with me write an email or ping me over telegram for your queries related to the services in one single channel we trade multiple instruments including diverse indices uh, from across the globe be it the majors from us and the germany or uk and the commodities including gold silver oil and gas connect with me for details and yes those who had asked me to recommend a broker which offers you a swap free account lowest spreads no hidden charges with which comes up and gives you a safer environment to trade with easier transactions and withdrawals from across the globe you can find the recommended broker link also in the channel and video description now considering the move here you can buy at 2567 see the day has just started and it can show you swings so you can buy here at 2567 levels expect it to move towards 2570 72 first resistance 76 levels the second 80 82 the third only and only if you see gold trading about 25 80 and 82 we can say that the bulls will take over and then you can look forward to a move towards 25 90 levels as well in between 25 86 is also one resistance but 25 90 92 levels will be seen beyond which sky is the limit on the while on the downside a selling entry now in gold is at 25 55 levels but then expect 25 50 first target 25 44 46 the next and then 25 40 the third if and only if it trades below 25 40 the chances will be very very high that we will look forward to 25 30 32 first target and then 25 20 levels will appear below 25 20 we can look forward to a greater greater correction here which can in fact take it towards 2500 levels very very soon take your trades and take your positions accordingly let's have a look at see what we had seen on gold applies to silver as well see drop retracement drop retracement drop retracement drop bearishness is increasing with every move that is the first point second point is after the drop it is trading under this retracement channel where are the highs 40 the 30 50 30 60 levels as long as now silver stays below 30 80 we should not be treating this as bullish this is very very clear here and in fact even if it trades above 30 80 uh, 31 31 20 is the zone where it is going to find maximum resistance i have been highlighting this since yesterday and in fact before as well uh, beautifully it has respected the zone so far if you look at the move here see this is the channel in which it is trading on the downside if it stays now below 30 dollars you can say that major bearishness may prevail we can look forward to 29.75 29.50 or in fact 29 dollar levels very very soon which is going to be the next support level 29 dollar levels be watchful stock stick rising the MACD is bearish it is crossed over it is tending to uh, trade or retrace a little on the upside be white watchful of this rsi is also comfortable coming to two hour, on the two hour chart see almost it was outside building a bands forming a support it is retracing and it has a potential to retrace towards 30 50 30 70 zone and uh, as as i mentioned till 30 80 we should not be treating this as bullish that is also clear the stock stick is rising here magd has seen a strong bearishness it can potentially converge crossover rsi is rising coming to three hour if you look at three archers what has happened here similar move increasing bearishness retracement resistance here at 30 40 30 60 very very strong and then 30 80 levels so yes it is trading with increasing bearishness also you should look at it as nice flag formation so after the rise here it is retraced also look at the support zone the same zone from where the rise was seen it has come down to the same levels 
so now 29 80 20 and 30 dollar levels are going to remain critical support zone for silver for the day stock has ticket bottom trying to rise MACD bearish rsi rising on the four hour the observation is same on the four hour charts uh, see first higher lows are seen there is a potential for a retracement but i will not treat this as a bullish as long as 38 is not taken very 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 clear and if you look at the move here it can potentially retrace now ideally a buying entry 3040 was the support 3040 is the good resistance and thus if you see silver trading above 3040 3050 zone that is the lower price above 3040 3050 you can initiate a buying entry but this is going to be riskier 3060 3065 is going to be the first target levels a uh, very very good resistance there and then 3080 levels still 3080 possibility of a reversal will be very very high stock has to MACD trading bearish, stock has ticket bottom and RSI is also flat here. Coming to daily chart. Now look at daily chart. See what did we discuss yesterday. Divide this into two. Look at the symmetry. Look at this formation. This is the channel in which it is trading. Highs are done. Where are the lows? Towards 28, 40, 50 zone. Can it move towards those? Anything is, everything is possible. What is happening today? Higher lows are seen. Where is the support? Here. So once it trades below 30 or 29, 80, we can look forward to a major move which is going to take it towards 29, uh, 50, 40 levels and then towards 28, 80, 29 dollar levels. Yes, if it drops below 29, 80, 30 dollar levels today, we are looking forward to a major correction. Stochastic dropping, MACD is in green and RSI also flat. Looking at this, I will recommend you to buy if you see silver trading above 30, 40, 30, 50 levels, but then be careful at 30, 60, 65 and then 30, 75, 80. Once it stays above 3075 80, we can look forward to more bullishness towards 31, 31, 20, which is the strongest resistance and which is going to be a major hurdle again for silver to break past by. On the downside, I will recommend you to sell if you see it is staying below 30, 20, 30, 15 levels, expect $30 and 29, 80, 2975. Once it trades below 2975, we can look forward to a major down move, which can take the prices potentially towards 29. 40 50 first target and then 29 dollar levels the next take your positions accordingly like share subscribe and comment join my mentorship batch join my signals channel reach out to me for your queries related to the services join the free telegram channel for live updates and join the channel memberships here on youtube to support the effort thank you have a great profitable trading day ahead do not miss to watch the next update before the us session thank you